would do a little week in my life this week because I'm going to Whistler today. We can go together. I just woke up about 20 minutes ago. I'm waiting for a coffee order to arrive. I've been packing up the house, so it looks a little crazy in here. I'm that girl who brings three extra large suitcases and a ski bag and a carry-on. But we're taking a sprinter van up there, so it shouldn't be a problem. I'm gonna go take my juice shots and... so icy that the guy was having to push it like in fear it and it was like slipping and sliding. Oh it's so snowy out. What we got here? Extra large coffee. That's my pumpkin spice tea. Thanks babe. We're getting picked up in two hours and I still have so much packing to do. I still have to pack up this entire closet and all of my toiletries. I'm the most high maintenance traveler. I've made some progress with packing. Packed all of these suitcases. I packed all my toiletries. And now I'm starting to pack up Luke's stuff. All my stuff's packed now, so I'm just gonna help him because if I don't pack for him, he will literally wait till the last second. Our ride has just arrived. We've got everything packed up. All packed up. Just like that, it's like magic, huh? The packing fairy came. It's like magic, I was just working the entire time. We're about to head to Whistler. I wanted to show you my outfit. Got this big puffer on from Fashion Nova. And this like little zip up I've been wearing all morning. And these shoes are incredible. The cutest snow boots ever. These are Emu Australia. I thrifted this hat. We're ready to go. like two hours from our place in Vancouver. I can't wait to see this place. I think it's gonna be really sick. We have arrived. Luke's getting it all opened up. This is the one. <laughs> oh. It's so cold up here. We just arrived at the house in Whistler and it's so pretty. I'm about to go check out the rest of the house. Looks like we've got a bedroom down here and a little loft area oh my gosh here's the kitchen holy cow this place is huge wow look at how beautiful this is and then we got the living room this kitchen is gorgeous holy cow i feel like a princess in this house and out here we have a hot tub in our backyard. Look how pretty the mountains are back there. They gave us a little gift basket. That's so nice. What's in here? Some, some wine and chocolate. These people are speaking my language. Whoa, this is like really sick. Holy shit. Cool! Wow! You just feel like a fucking baller when you do this shit. <laughs> Let's go check out the upstairs. Is this a master bedroom or a guest? This is probably the master. Oh my god. Whoa, these are oh some sexy god. bedrooms. Whoa, this is, this is our bedroom, babe. Oh my gosh, there's a downstairs too. Yeah, the downstairs is fucking sick. We got Luke taste testing. All the snacks they gave us. Mm -hmm. You like this? Ooh, this little gumdrop. These gummies are so good. It's night one in Whistler, and the boys just found out that the lifts are open till five, so they are headed out. It's like dark out. We got the opportunity to send it. You guys will, you guys will find out like where the secret path is exactly. for us. So we'd be a one, here. yeah, one house walk over. Oh, that looks sick. 
and then we assume it, like that's where we're trying to get to. And that looks like you can probably take this back down and hit that again. On our last ski trip, Luke left an entire Jack Daniels bottle in his, oh, in his ski bag. And what happened, babe? Well, we were traveling and you know, in the, in the plane, it's just shaking around, so it smashed. It literally <laughs> shattered. Yeah. Everything in his ski bag, it smells, smelt like whiskey. There was shards everywhere. All right, babe, love you. I love you too. Uh -oh. Now that the boys are out of the house, I have this entire place to myself, which is amazing because I love my alone time. I'm just gonna put some groceries away and settle in. I just heard something. I'm scared. I just made this smoothie. I wanna go show you our bedroom because it's gorgeous. This is our room. Out here is a balcony, which I can show you in the morning when it's light out. And then it's got this gorgeous mirror right here. Here is the master bathroom. Look how big this closet is. Can never have too much stuff, right? Then I unpacked all my toiletries. I'm the kind of person who needs to unpack right when I get somewhere. I just love everything to be organized and to be able to see everything. We just ordered some DoorDash for dinner because we don't have the many groceries. That's the plan for tonight. I just got out of the shower and now I'm going to do some skincare. I feel like my skin has been looking pretty good lately. I usually struggle with acne and dryness and sensitivity. But I've been drinking two of these a day, and I've also been taking this new supplement. I think it's really been keeping my skin happy. We ordered Uber Eats, but they dropped it off at a different house, so we need to go for a hike. Are you going to come, or is it just going to be... Do you want me to come? No, you'll probably get cold. We secured the Earls. Secured. Looks like we got a steak. What is this? Wings, what kind you get? burger, I got a salad with a salmon, my favorite. cold today so I'm so bundled up. Are you ready babe? I'm not gonna take my camera out today so I might get some clips on my phone. I'm sure it's gonna be gorgeous but otherwise I'll see you guys afterwards. We just got off the mountain and it was such a fun day today. We are unpacking some groceries. We got the fire running. We are so toast from the mountain today. We have like a private trail to get back to our cabin. And it was like such a trek. It was like so much powder and we just like kept falling and like having to walk, but it was so fun. So now we're so toast. I've just put on some PJs. I'm feeling so cozy and I'm starting to get hungry. So I'm going to make some dinner. These are my favorite PJs of all time. They run me of Victoria's Secret PJs. They're super, super comfy and like silky. Need to order more colors. Rice going here. This is a teriyaki sauce I need. And then a little bit of stir fried veggies. This is the ultimate combo. It's day three in Whistler. We are waking up a little sore today. It's pretty early in the morning, so we're just having some coffee. I think I'm going to do a little journaling and reading just because we're not going straight on the mountain today. We have a really fun day today because Luke's brother is coming with his girlfriend, so we're going to add another couple to the house, which will be so fun. And 
Also, we have a private chef coming to the house tonight. It's gonna be a really fun day. Just changed into my under layer for skiing today. I forgot how much I love this one. It's like a snake print, but I got it from ASOS. They have their own ski line. And it's actually really nice. Like this, this keeps me warm on the mountain. And then I just put a little puffer on to walk around the house because I'm so cold. But when I go skiing, I'll definitely put on like a full on ski ski jacket and pants. Staying warm on ski trips is always my number one priority. makeup on and put my hair in this slick bun and I just got an Instagram photo which is always good and I wanted to show you my outfit because it's so cozy it's like this fuzzy two-piece set and the cardigan goes like all the way to my calves so it's like very elegant and classy and the chef just got here so I'm gonna go hang out downstairs. Maybe there's, I think they're gonna serve like wine and appetizers soon. So that's what I'm gonna get up to. chilling by the fire it was so nice having someone come to the house and serve us and cook for us and I'm feeling so grateful for this whole trip and this beautiful house and being able to ski like it's all such a luxury and I'm, I'm feeling so happy that I get to do this Today, I'm trying to be quiet because I don't want to wake anybody up, but it's like 6 a.m. right now. I've been awake since like 4.30. For some reason, I just couldn't sleep. And I did my skincare. Let me show you my outfit. It's this like fuzzy set. It's like these pants with like cargo pockets. It's like wearing a blanket. Got my cutie little shoes on. But today we're gonna go skiing for sure because Luke's brother and his girlfriend got here. So now there's like five of us and we're all gonna ski together, which will be so fun. Skiing in like a gr big group of people is the best. And then later tonight we have a dinner reservation at High's Steakhouse. I'm not sure if I'm feeling like going out to dinner though because the the private chef dinner last night was like so good but my stomach starts to hurt if I eat out too much just because like the food is so rich and I'm just so used to like eating clean so I'm thinking I might suggest that I make dinner for everybody tonight but going out for dinner could be fun too so we'll see what happens and that's kind of the plan for today. Just spent the morning 
on YouTube. I just uploaded my first video, which I got so nervous about, but it's up now and I'm so proud of myself for figuring out all the equipment I need and figuring out how to use the camera and then figuring out how to edit and upload and all that. So my first video is posted, which of course you can go back and watch. I just put my base layer on for skiing today. I wear this like thick fleece jacket over a silk turtleneck and then two pairs of long underwear because I do not want to get cold on the slopes. And then I'm making myself some breakfast, so I'll go show you what I'm cooking up. Ready for a day three of skiing. I think it's gonna be a little colder today. I'm the only snowboarder. Only snowboarder. I'm the coolest one. Is that right? Yeah. Uh, I mean, I guess you look pretty cool. Skiing and you're all black. <laughs> today I'm wearing Luke's off-white fanny pack to hold like my water and lip oil. Kind of looks cute. I wish I could bring my camera on the mountain, but I just don't think it would be a good idea because my camera is so big yeah, and I fall a lot. But I'll take some clips on my yeah. phone to show you. Yeah. And I'll see you guys later. Just got out of the shower and put on my cozy robe. Got myself a glass of wine. And I'm on cozy mode today. I got so cold for some reason when I was snowboarding. So I was only out there for like three hours and I'm so happy to be all back in warm. I took a massive shower. Now I'm gonna get ready, start getting ready for tonight because we're going to a nice steakhouse for dinner. And I want to look cute. I want to maybe try to get a photo and I have some cute outfits planned. So I thought maybe we could get ready together since I have a ton of time. I don't think we're leaving for like four hours. And I have the whole place to myself right now because Luke is still on the mountain. So let's get ready. I felt like my skin needed some TLC after being on the mountain. So I'm doing my skincare before I put makeup on. I also feel like my makeup will look better when I have my skincare freshly done. So I use this LED mask every single day, morning and night. And today I'm gonna use it three times. I'm literally obsessed with it. I think it's one of the major things that has helped me clear up my skin. It is incredible and it's only three minutes long, so. There's never any excuse to not do it. Okay, I've got my little setup on the floor here with all my makeup. Let's get ready. extensions and do like two braids with like a beanie or a hat or something. I'm trying to pick out an outfit for tonight and I can't decide if I like this or not. It's definitely cute for dinner and I would probably wear it with these boots. I feel like it's a little big on me, so it kind of is a little bit unflattering. But maybe I'm just being crazy. Okay, I decided on the black jumpsuit. And then I'm just doing all black with my favorite black Zara puffer. And this hat I got at the Christmas market. And my favorite snowshoes. day 
I've been waking up so early every morning here in Whistler. Right now it's like 6. But I've been up since like 5. I've just done my skincare. And now I'm gonna go downstairs and make a matcha. <laughs> Loading up on the daily essentials, a little bit of whiskey. I think we've taken whiskey shots every day on the mountain so far, and it makes skiing actually so fun because you just loosen up and you get all warm from it. It's like my favorite thing, actually. First bottle was down the hatch. We already finished one bottle between like three of us. So we're on to the second one. And we're gonna head out a little bit earlier today. I feel like we never get enough time on the mountain. I've been putting these toe warmers on every day. And then I also have hand warmers. These are so key. And I've been bringing a little water in my fanny pack to stay hydrated. To the mountain for the day. I think we're gonna have a huge day today and try to go over to Black Home Mountain because we've been sticking to Whistler. Look at how gorgeous today is. It's like so foggy out. It's gonna be all cloudy on the mountain. I just got back from a huge day on the mountain. We're now in the kitchen cooking up some things. I just made these protein balls and Joel's cooking up some drinks. so fun the last one was amazing so that's the plan for today it's gonna be a great day here in Whistler I'm gonna try to get some Instagram content I am thinking maybe about doing like a bikini photo in the snow, in the balcony, or in the jacuzzi because the hot tub here is so pretty. So I just laid out some swimsuits. I'm trying to pick out an outfit to wear for the photo. Thinking maybe like this hat, this fuzzy hat with like my pink bikini. I'm going to try them all on and see which one looks the cutest. I'm going to bring this reflector out there to try to get some more light on me because it is pretty cloudy out today. I can't decide if I should put on makeup for this bikini photo, but it could be nice to like go all out. I just did my makeup. I decided to do my makeup and hair for this photo because I think it would be even better. And I'm wearing this Boutine LA like pink bikini. I'm gonna wear this for the photo also. I just got back from taking some photos in the jacuzzi. I can't tell if I like them or not, but I tried my best. I just went for a walk and for some reason my mood just dropped really quickly. So I'm gonna do a little workout and I think that will help me feel better. Grab my eight pound weights and I'm gonna do a Sammy Clark workout here in the basement.
slept in a little bit later today, so I'm feeling very well rested. We have a massage therapist coming to the house this morning, which will be so nice. And we got a ton of snow last night. So skiing is gonna be so good today. Today's our last day here, so I wanna get a lot of time on the mountain. I've been breaking out yesterday, like the past couple days. It gets from drinking wine every day, so that's the one thing I think I'm excited for this trip to be over is I won't be drinking as much, so my skin will hopefully clear up. But I've been working so hard on my skin, so I get sad when I see breakouts starting to happen, but it's all worth it. I have, I've been having so much fun on this trip. I also want to show you my outfit. It's like this two-piece jumpsuit and long cardigan. This is just like my little morning fit. to head out for our last day on the mountain it's gonna be a snowy ski day today I just got a massage this morning too so I'm feeling so relaxed and just ready to ready to get on the mountain it's gonna be a good day <laughs> hi I am getting ready for dinner right now <laughs> and I'm doing my hair I thought I would just turn on the camera to hang out with you guys. Skiing today was so fun. I had one of my favorite ski days of all time today. We were having so much fun. It was a snow day. It was snowing all day. And we skied it for so long on the Blackcomb side, which is like the other side of the mountain, or the other mountain. And that was our first time going over to that side. So it was like a totally new area. It wasn't crowded at all. And the snow was so good. I felt like I was just like floating through the mountain. It was so fun. And I've been home for a couple hours now. And we're going to Il Caminetto tonight, which I've heard is amazing. So I'm really excited. And I thought I would do like a slick back model bun because my hair got kind of oily from the massage this morning. So I put some spiky glue and it's working magic. I'm also wearing this cat suit to dinner, which is like honestly so comfy. I'm trying to decide if I should go skiing tomorrow because we're not leaving till four. So I could technically go for a full ski day. But it might just be too overwhelming for me because I need to pack up the whole house in the morning. If not, I would just go hang out in Whistler Village for the day. Which I haven't done yet, so that could be fun too. And then we're staying tomorrow night in Vancouver. And then I go back to California. Our flight is the next day. I think the hair turned out pretty good. I literally have the smallest amount of hair, so my bun is tiny. It's kind of a vibe. Now I'm just putting some jewelry on. Got my little Dior necklace, and my rings, and my bracelet, my earrings. And then, let me show you my outfit. I've got this cat suit and a vest. And I can't decide if I should do like heeled boots or just like some fluffy snow boots. It is the next day. Today's our last day in Whistler. And we have to leave the house in an hour. And I still have a ton of packing to do so I'm a little stressed out but I just wanted to say good morning and I think today I'm gonna go explore Whistler. We have to leave this 
vacation rental at noon and then we're not getting picked up to go to Vancouver until four. So I have four hours to just like chill. So I think I'm gonna go hang out around the village since I haven't really explored it yet. Maybe, maybe do some shopping. So that's the plan for today. We have all our stuff packed up. We're leaving the house. Luke's Damn, going skiing time. today. One last run. Now we're going all to the village. Yep. Goodbye house. Goodbye. You're that so was beautiful. Fun. That was so fun. Thank you, babe. Yeah. That was such a fun trip. That was one of my favorite trips of all time, actually. This is by far my best, my favorite ski trip. And ski trips are the best, so I think it would be my favorite trip, yeah. Yeah, because ski trips are the best types of trips. We have three more ski trips planned this year, actually. So I'm really excited. We're going to Big Bear, Mammoth, and Japan. And I'm gonna vlog all of it. So subscribe to see those, because it's coming up in the next couple months. We got some pizza for the ride to Vancouver. Pepperoni hot honey. After a big day on the slopes. Gas. It's the next day, and we stayed the night in Vancouver. We're at the Fairmont Hotel at the airport right now, because we have a flight today to go to San Diego, so. Last night we drove from Whistler to Vancouver and we just thought we'd stay the night to make the travel easier. And I'm gonna be heading home for the holidays. So subscribe to see my upcoming YouTube vlogs in Encinitas with my family. I can't wait to see them and it's gonna be a very festive time. So thank you so much for watching this Whistler vlog. It was such a fun trip. I'm so happy I could take you guys along with me. I'll see you in next week's vlog. Love you.